Hello, I'm Joseph Vargo with SimplyMac.com, your premier Apple specialist. We have our headquarters in Salt Lake City, Utah with eight retail locations in Utah, Idaho, and Wyoming. I'm going to show you how to make the iPad a better ebook reader. So I'm going to first tap on my uh, section here that says books, and in here I have a lot of different books listed. I'm going to go into the iBooks app, which is going to be the most popular way to uh, read your books on the iPad. So in here we're brought to a shelf, and it's going to pull up a lot of different books that I have on this iPad. Um, it opened up the last book that I was opening. If I hit library, it takes me back just a second. So in here we can pick the different books that I want. Uh, if I open up The Count of Monte Cristo here, it's going to open up where I left off. And I'm going to show you a few neat things on here. If I didn't know what the word sailor meant right here, if I hold my finger on that word, I can uh, see a definition of that word if I type define, and it tells me what that is. I can also change the background color. Right now it's white. If I prefer something a little different, I can hit the big A button and then change the theme from normal to sepia, uh, which makes it a little yellow color, or night, which makes it a little bit darker. It's more black on white instead of white on black. Uh, I can also make it go full screen by swiping full screen on. Gets rid of all the extra stuff on the outsides, which people like quite a bit. And I can make the text larger by hitting the larger A and it makes my text bigger and bigger. I can also make the brightness go down or the brightness go up. So if I'm reading at night, it's kind of nice to turn it all the way down. It's actually quite bright. And uh, I'm going to go back to normal here, change my color back. Again, I'm Joseph Vargo, and I just showed you how to make the iPad a better ebook reader.